Nowadays, cats get Pro Tools a mic, get a beat off of some dude's mixtape, and it's that easy, and it's hip hop records, shit, quote unquote. But that's not hip hop, you know what I'm saying? And if that is, then you guys can have that shit. Because I don't want to be a part of that, you know? The, the music, quote unquote, the rap movement was about, you know, combating negative forces in the government and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? I don't even like that word hip hop, man. That shit to me is like, it's, you know, it's, 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 I'm disgusted by that word really, man, when people use that word. It's like, to me, you know, I mean, that's not what I call the shit, you know. You have to force yourself, you have to push yourself into the moment and shit. Sometimes that means you got to do what you feel the most. And for me, that's like improvising, freestyling, going up there, knowing I have the preparation, but almost feeling unprepared and just trusting in the moment and going with the flow. That's what I'm about. And that's, that to me has brought me here across the planet and shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's what it's about, being present and charging shit. All the way, it's like surfing. You gotta drop in and commit and get fucking barreled. You know what I'm saying? I will give my life for the evening box. Oh, God, different levels of spirituality, right? For someone who is, you know, a serial killer, I wouldn't expect him to go give his kidney to somebody who needs a kidney, but over time, if he can learn to put the blade away and not kill somebody, then, you know, that's just becoming, you know, that's his process of evolution. Um, I grew up in a very spiritual family, you know. I was, uh, my grandfather was with me throughout my, up to my teenagehood, so, you know, I know about, you know, Ethiopia, and I know about Christ, and, you know, I know about the prophets that have come before us, and I know, I know the truth, man. And I've experienced it as well, so I've been, I've been taught it and I've lived it so, you know, I'm just, I'm present, man, and, and I just want to keep, keep, keep smashing on motherfuckers, man. Cowboys in the end of years. Cowboys in the end of years. Cowboys in the end of years. Real cowboys.
from everyday shit, man. You know, uh, having to go through a border and, and have my family pulled out at 11 o'clock at night. My wife's pregnant, my three kids are in 30 degree temperature while they search my car for illegal aliens and I smuggle them in the fucking gas station or some shit. You know, and not being able to respond the way be humiliated by, you know, cats with badges and shit, you know, in front of my family. You know, that that shit's that shit'll happen forever, man. So the inspiration will be there. Change change has to has to it's inevitable, man. And I'm going through the shit and I'll be damned if my kids go through it. You know what I'm saying? So I stand up for the shit when they're when it's happening to me in front of them, so they can see, and remember how passionate and I spoke up about it. You know, instead of sitting around and allowing it to happen, I'll make a scene about it. Rocking with my head Yeah.